Hey guys, welcome to Comparing AI, where we explore AI together. In this video, I found four tools that make ChatGPT even more powerful. And two of these tools are absolutely exploding in search volume right now. They're getting super popular. So let's jump into my computer and look at how these tools can improve your everyday life. So the first one is still ChatGPT, but when it's not loading like this, you can actually go to platform.openai.com slash playground. And this will always work when ChatGPT is at capacity. So if you need a workaround, you can just go here and it basically works the same. It's just a little bit of a different interface. I don't really play around with any of this stuff on the side. Let's say brainstorm ideas for a blog post about the best AI tools for marketers. And you click submit and there you go. While this one's not working, you can just go to the playground. So I have this bookmarked as well. So now let's go to the second tool, which is called Notion AI. Now this is a free writing tool at the moment, but you do have to join the wait list. However, if you maybe you've heard of Notion, it has like 30 million users. It's a note taking app and you can do everything on it. But let's just do um, when you click slash, you can click ask AI to write and let's brainstorm ideas on what do we want to brainstorm viral brainstorm ideas on viral videos for a YouTube channel about AI. So let's see if I can get some ideas for my channel. And just like that, you get all of these ideas. Now the good thing about Notion AI is it's actually a good editor. So if you want an AI writing assistant, I made a video here as well with the best free AI text generators. And now let's actually write an introduction on one of these topics. So let's make a article outline about this. So let's ask AI to write an intro paragraph for a YouTube video on this topic. And Notion will write that. So I'm just going to copy it, bring it down here, and then you can ask AI to do other things. So as you can see, you can improve the writing, fix spelling. Let's make it longer here. Continue writing. And as you see, you kind of get the point. So let's insert that. And then actually, let's say we want to summarize this so I can do that. Let's summarize it and it'll bring it down into its core ideas. Let's replace that. So far, we have AI technology has been advancing at a rapid pace and is now being used in many aspects of our lives. From driverless cars to facial recognition software, AI has been making headlines for some time now. But what about the ethical implications? In this video, we will explore the ethical implications of AI from its impact on privacy, blah, blah, blah. So not bad or just starting with a blank canvas. And it is really good for editing as well. You can ask AI, click improve writing. This is the one I use the most because I'm not the best writer. And they have announced that this will be a paid tool in the future, but right now it's in alpha. So you can join the wait list. It took me about four weeks to get accepted, but it's well worth it because you're getting like a tool that's gonna cost 40, 50 bucks or however much in the future. You can get it for free right now if you just join the wait list. So take advantage of this while it lasts. This is a really good tool if you need to create content or do any writing needs because yeah, you just click the ask AI button, that toolbar will hover up and look at all these prompts that you can get. So that's tool number two. Looking at the third tool, it's called Perplexity AI where you can ask anything. And this is like a Google search killer. And just real quick, I wanna show you the search volume. So if we go to Google Keyword Planner, where you can see search volume for different trends, we have the latest data until December. January will probably come out soon. It's like February 3rd right now, I think. But anyways, look, this just exploded out of nowhere. 480 searches up to almost 100,000 searches last month. So going completely insanely viral. Let's just show you what this is. Perplexity AI, ask anything. So it's an answer search engine that delivers accurate answers to questions using large language models, whatever. The best way is to show you how it works. You guys, this is really cool. I need to play around with this more, but let's say you're using this like Google and you want to ask it a question. It's gonna show up data with sources to the information. So I'm in the crypto niche as well. And let's say I wanna do like, um, what's the difference between Coinbase and Binance? And I was shocked with how good the answers were. 
So Coinbase is a US-based exchange designed for beginners with a simple interface and limited transaction types. Binance, on the other hand, has a steep learning curve, supports advanced users, and provides international traders with hundreds of currency trading options. And then it gives you sources from Investopedia, Cointelegraph, Forbes. This is where it got the information. So if you're looking for a review on a product, you can ask it these questions. And this is accurate. This is 100% true uh, because I review the cryptocurrency exchanges on my other channel. And you can even go deeper. So like, is Binance available? in Ontario, Canada. So I live in Ontario and Binance is banned here. So let's say I enter this. So it should say it's banned. Binance is currently prohibited in Ontario and users are restricted from using its services. It hopes to come back in 2024, but until then Ontarians can't use Binance. This is 100% correct. And it's absolutely insane that I got this right. And I guess it's using these sources. So I haven't played around with this too much, but the times that I have, it gives me extremely accurate answers, at least on this topic. And this is going completely viral. So that's Perplexity AI, a search engine that gives you the sources to where it's finding the information. How to gain muscle quickly. To gain muscle quickly, it's important to maximize muscle building by eating more and training with heavy weights, a variety of exercises. And then you can ask follow-up questions to keep learning and digging deeper on this topic. And if you want to, you can go into the articles that it got this information from. So it built with science, build muscle fast, and then you can get the full source, I guess. Or you can just keep asking it follow-up questions. Very, very cool tool. And the last one we have here is Suggesty. So this is similar kind of to Perplexity AI. And essentially this is a Chrome extension that is free to use. And every time you make a search on Google, it will show the ChatGPT result alongside with it so you can get faster answers. So let me just show you how it works. I'm gonna add this to Chrome, click add extension, and let's type something in. Um, what is the metaverse? Oh, well now they're charging money. Oh, there we go. So down here you have your regular Google search results. So they're showing ads and then what is the metaverse. But then up here, as you can see by Suggesty, it gives you this answer here. So it gives you a little faster answer. Let's do, what is ChatGPT? And again, Suggesty is giving you answers. Or let's do best foods for weight loss. And as you see, you get the idea. This one's giving you show more. And this is a little way you can just increase the power of your browser extension and get chat GPT answers every time you search at the top. And then you also get the Google snippets, which you can compare with. So it just helps you get information faster. Now, those are the tools that I have for today. Let me know what you think, and they will all be linked in the description below. Thanks for watching. Drop a like if this was helpful, and I'll see you in the next video.